In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a forest knife like a pro. Hello, it's Donald here. Welcome to my channel. A lot of people got intimidated by using a knife to cut the flowers. They worry about will cut themselves. Totally get it. It looks scary. I remember my first time using a knife. I was so scared. So today I want to share with you a proper way how to use a forest knife. Also, I will show you a bonus tip on how to make your flowers last longer when you use your knife. So please stay until the end of this video. Before I show you how to use a knife, I want to share with you some of the different style knives. The first one we have here is the inexpensive knife. This is probably the most inexpensive knife in the market. But it still does the job. I like to use it when I'm going out to set up a wedding or events. Don't need to worry about bringing it back but only things, this is not so strong, the blade is a little thin. The next one, we have the Oasis Strict Knife. This is a folding knife. I like this color because it's yellow. When I drop it into the garbage or the floor, it's easy to find it. The last one is the Curved Knives. This is my favorite. I like to use them I feel they have a better grip on the flowers, but this is just my personal preference. Okay, let me show you how to use it properly. The best way to do this is to hold your hand flat and then just roll your finger over. Make sure your finger is 90 degree parallel to the blade and lock your finger in place. So what we are doing here is we are using our arm to pull and don't move the finger, otherwise it's easy to cut yourself. Here we have some stems. Let me show you how to cut this. You put your stems in here and then use your arm to pull. Your blade is 45 degree in angle and the other hands are pulling away from the blade. This is a joint action. So you will see they have a 45 degree cut, very clean and it's good when you're using this to put it into the container or oasis foam. Let me show you one more time. You put your stems in between your finger and the blade this basically is approaching the stems and helping to put a little pressure on it. You pull the stem away and then the blade is cut into the stem. I will suggest you to get some softer stems to practice first, like tulips and irises, before you move on to the medium stems or the harder stems. One more bonus tips I want to share with you Make sure you clean your blade every day before you start your day and before you go home. You don't want to have any bacteria on your blade to transfer to the stems. It will shorten your flower's life. Okay, that's it for now. Remember, it takes time to get used to it. Practice this motion to cutting your stems. I'm sure you will know how to use a forest knife like a pro in no time. If you found value in this video, please make sure you hit the like button and share with your friends. Also on my channel, we have many videos for you to enjoy it. Please check those out as well. Thank you for watching. See you next time.